Well, ladies and gentlemen, we gotta talk about this one immediately, okay? What's going on, Call of Duty haters? What's going on, Call of Duty refugees? What's going on, Call of Duty D-Riders? Because right now, everybody's out there, okay? Everybody's, like, going crazy right now. Because just the other day when they revealed the first gameplay for zombies, yeah, everybody was, like, bricked up. People had nothing but good things to say. But then they reveal a little bit more. They reveal this man by the name of uh, Liberty Blue Balls or Liberty, Liberty Balls or yeah. Liberty Falls. Yeah, that's the one, Falls, right? And right now... Now everyone is out on the streets, okay? Gamers are not stopping, okay? People dropping DDTs left and right. Seconds dropping Tombstone pile drivers. And there's a video that I want to show you, okay? Like the video if you just wanted zombies feeling like zombies. Dislike the video if you like zombies being like multiplayer, war zone-ish, and you like the, the friendly, friendly BDC. I, I wanna know where you guys at, but you guys are not ready for this one. Check this out, roll it. Six, it's gotta be said, Black Ops 6 Zombies is being blasted with hate right now. Yeah. Absolutely, the community is up in arms after the new reveals that happened yesterday at Call of Duty Next, Dang. where they gave us this Liberty Falls trailer, which looked fantastic, but then we saw the actual gameplay itself, and Call of Duty fans are just not happy with this right now, man. Yeah. I can't go anywhere. Twitter, Reddit. Yeah, not happy means like this. Yeah, this is this is first reactions, and and honestly, I don't blame anybody, man. I don't blame anybody. This is looking like multiplayer right now, bro. These seconds took four years, man. That's the thing, though. What you you did not know? Yeah, we're hearing that these seconds took four years now. Think about this for a second, right? Black Ops One that came out a decade plus ago. That game was made in like a year and a half. Black Ops 2, year and a half, some even saying that under a year and a half, because, you know, when Black Ops 1 was out, they were still putting out content, the DLCs, for another year, right? Meanwhile, working on Black Ops 2, so yeah, Black Ops 2 was made less than two years, and that's one of the most beloved Call of Duty game ever. Zombies was really, really good in that one, right? And then we had Black Ops 3 Zombies, that was next, and Black Ops 3 as a full game as well, right? And, and yeah, Black Ops 3 also had its uh, problems uh, with the campaign and the multiplayer, but Zombies-wise, bro, everybody loved it, okay? Like, a lot of people were, like, uh, uh, happy with it, especially the HUD and, and all that. And, and more so than the HUD, the maps felt genuinely good, fun, and Zombies-like. Yeah, people are complaining about the HUD, and yes, uh, the HUD, uh, it's the little stuff like that that makes and breaks, right? When people are complaining, I understand, man, even I don't like the HUD, uh, the HUD makes and breaks it, right? Like, this one is feeling like a Warzone rehash map right now, so that's where most people are at, but wait for it, we got a lot more. YouTube comments anywhere, people are just bashing Liberty Falls right now, they are not happy in any way, shape, or form, and I think there is some very valid criticism out there. The big thing about this is, initially, we got Terminus Island, we got yeah. the trailer for that, followed by some actual gameplay, which was kind of Activision's way of trying- Yeah, just look at that, without the HUD, man, especially nighttime zombies, be mass right and, and this does feel like zombies a little bit right or i should say more than just a little bit now that we have seen this this uh this map this map is definitely clouding our judgment and understandably because previously what we were looking at was just the the, the, the gameplay that was uh, beefed up with like RTX 50,000 right there, you know, 50 billion or something like that, which is not even out yet. Bruh. But you get the idea, right? Like they showed us very hand selective gameplay. This is how the game is going to look when you get to play on PlayStation, PC and Xbox, right? This is how it's going to look like. And uh, honestly, for four years, uh, we expected more than that. Now, there's good, there are some good things about it too that we're gonna talk about. I know some of you, some of you would be saying that like what, bro? Like what, man? Like what, yeah. man? Uh, we're, we're gonna get down to it, stud muffins. We're gonna get down to it. But when you look at the perk machines, man, like the perk machines looking like from Timu, from Wish.com, and all that. I mean, I mean, they be, they had me looking like this, bro. Like what the hell is going on, man? These seconds had four years. <laughs> These seconds had four years man damn for in terms of multiplayer the multiplayer a lot of people are like yeah that look I you know that look I some people are shaking too but with zombies oh man everybody's like out there I, I want to know like which which of these uh, uh homies out there look closer to you do, do, like do you look like this in real life Bruh. do you is that you is that you hey, hey, hey is that you Roger Roger mr. Roger is that is that you is that you maybe we, we got yeah I, I see no j456 in the background as well MC sports talk right there damn homie like yeah the gamers are out there right now man but understandably so like for four years looks like that they were just smelling each other farts uh second BBC's uh, doing helicopters with their release. I don't know what they were doing in Urdu. Yar, char sal. Char sal ho gay. Are kutte deo bacheo. Tanu sharam nahi andi. Yar, fans ka itna, itna kiyo lene. 
मुझे पता है कि कभी कभी लेना होता है लेकिन इतना भी क्या आ गया कि तुम्हें लेना ही लेना है लेना ही लेना है चार साल अरे चूतियो तू चूसना तो बंद कर दो ना चार साल से चूस ही जा रहे हो चूस ही जा रहे हो अरे फैंस का दिवाला निकल गया दिवालिया निकल गया यहाँ पे अरे पहचो पह खत्म हो गए हैं और कितना लोग हैं कितना लपेटोगे लेडीज एंड जर्मन मैं दी सक इज क्रेजी ओके दैट्स ऑल वन ऑफ से बट वेट फॉर इट आई टू कॉम्बैट ऑल द पीपल दैट वर लीकिंग द मल्टीप्लेयर दे थॉट ओके वी'ल जस्ट शो सम स्ट्रेट अप ज़ॉम्बीज गेम प्ले सम ऑफिशियल स्टफ दैट दे कैन कंट्रोल वेल दैट गेम प्ले लुक्ड फैंटास्टिक इट लुक्ड जस्ट लाइक रेगुलर ज़ॉम्बीज हैज सच अ क्रीपी वाइब राउंड बेस ज़ॉम्बीज एवरीवनस लाइक मैन वी आर बैक वी आर एब्सोल्युटली बैक दिस इज इनक्रेडिबल वर्क एंड हैव सो मच फन दिस ईयर एंड देन येस्टरडे वी सॉ लिबर्टी फॉल्स एंड द ट्रेलर्स लुक्ड फैंटास्टिक बट व्हेन पीपल सॉ द एक्चुअल गेम प्ले दे जस्ट सी be ridiculously let down and i think I wanna, that's because of i, I want to show you something real quick this is going to piss you off even more okay couple wait for things it. number a it doesn't number really a? look like a zombies map in a lot of ways look at that juggernaut machine straight from wish.com you suck is crazy and, and here's the thing though when people saw the original gameplay the other day the, which was control gameplay people said nothing but good things even i was like holy crap like i'm shocked right oh my god oh my god i don't know what's going on like how is that <laughs> how is it that good finally where zombies is coming back i said that a lot of other people said that you guys were saying that and the reason you want to know the reason why people were saying that was because it looked good it genuinely looked good and this don't look good so people are just being honest there are a few people that are liking it and if you're liking it hey man like that's perfectly fine by me though if you like it you like it if you don't like it you don't like it simple okay simple simple but generally speaking i feel like people that are not liking it are the ones that have played uh, the good maps right what i mean by the good maps is like the black ops ones the black ops 2s the the black ops 3 zombies oh hell to a certain degree even infinite warfare zombies Bruh. right <laughs> for for whatever worth that was i mean like infinite warfare zombies had a strong fan base and after all infinite warfare zombies had like it, its own style why because lee ross did try his absolute best and people respected that about lee ross right he also pieced out right uh, from uh, activision right jason blendell uh, and there was another guy craig i believe craig not craig i believe he's still there there was another jimmy z jimmy zelinski yeah yeah jimmy zelinski uh, the guy that was uh, there around like black ops 1 and i believe a little bit around black ops 2 as well or maybe fully i'm not totally sure about that but i want to show you something that will piss you off even more now they these sickers have showed us the liberty balls or liberty falls the intro cinematic right where you see rick toffen okay where you see rick toffen and suckers were shaking i mean everybody was like cream <laughs> we got the mr mr awful waffles man six days ago bro six days ago these things are crazy this looks so good i was like oh my god bro like damn damn i mean damn bro yeah this look good man holy smoke is like like the video if you if they had you in the first half Because after seeing the gameplay of the nightmare without the HUD and uh, beefed up with like RTX 50 50 billion, that gameplay looked good. I'm still gonna say, bro, like that looked good. But what they showed today, right? The gameplay that we just saw, we saw the real gameplay, right? Like YouTubers, we we saw the real gameplay. Now make no mistake, we're seeing the live stream gameplay, so it's gonna be pixelated. The quality, I'm not judging the graphics. Graphics. Um, I'm not necessarily judging the graphics. Uh, to be fair, though, graphics aren't looking like too impressive nor too crazy, right? We're, we're seeing the pixelated version, but the textures are gonna be like that when the game, when you get to see uh, or get to play the game by yourself. But I don't think graphics are gonna be this bad when you play it by yourself, if that makes sense. They aren't gonna be super impressive. Call of Duty graphics have never been impressive, but Black Ops 3 Zombies, when you look at it even to this day, the graphics look very good. I mean, hell, if if you play Black Ops 2 not on PS3 or 360, but if you play Black Ops 2 uh, on PC, you will look at it that the graphics. I mean, they still hold up uh, to this day. So I'm not necessarily complaining about the graphics. Yes, it was stream quality. Yes, the gameplay wasn't, or I should say, graphically uh, speaking, resolution wise. Yeah, that's the real uh, term here. Resolution. is going to be better when you get to play the game but when you look at the perk machine bro the uh, yeah they're not going to change bro they're going to look the same like juggernaut like these perk machines looking so cheap cheaply made like they were so good looking uh, in prior games so there are certain aspects about it like the textures and all that i mean it's over bro like if you don't like the gumball machine don't look that good either they showed in the intro in, in the intro cinematic they look good but in the actual on the actual map when you get to play it by yourself it don't even look good so yeah this is this is a trailer this is the intro look at that amazing like yeah i'm going to say that because it looks very very good it does look very good 
so this looks good you have this and this is the gameplay <laughs> This is the gameplay you get right after. I mean, these things are crazy, but wait for it. It looks more like a multiplayer map. It looks like an open world kind of a vibe, similar to what we had with Modern Warfare 3 with their open world. Yeah, look at look at the, the, the perk machines, bro. It looks so bad. Damn, it looks like DMZ wars on multiplayer right now. Yeah, like, oh, you want to purchase that? You want to purchase that? Speed Cola. I see that it's Speed Cola, damn it. We don't need million things on the screen. World Zombies and Urzikstam. It kind of looks like that. It's small town, Damn. West Virginia. Like, if you told me that this was, like, going to be an update in Fallout 76, I would believe you. But it doesn't really stop there. People are upset that there's no new boss zombies that were added. Yo, that's Letty from Fast and Furious? What? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yo, Letty, since when Letty was playing? Damn. Yo, you gotta, yo, Vin Diesel is, like, doing everything for the family, and you out here leaving the family behind and playing Call of Duty Zombies? Come on, girl. Like, come like on, basically man. all the same boss Damn. zombies that we've seen before. They are here. That's pretty much it. We have the same wonder weapons with the return of the jet gun coming back. So it's kind of like they just took a multiplayer map almost and then threw some zombies in there and kind of called it a day. That's what I'm gathering from the community. If I go and look at like Noah J, for example, look at the comments on his channel here. Bro, why do they keep intertwining zombies and Warzone? Why can't we yeah. get the OG shit? My disappointment is immeasurable. My day is ruined. Abraham Lincoln, of course. Getting more disappointed the more I watch zombies gameplay after this shit i'll probably have to play black ops 3 again for the next Damn. four years and Damn. it just continues on and on Damn. like that if you scroll through. there's a uh, seconds are beefing big time right now and what i just noticed is that this is uh, apparently not stream quality gameplay this is a uh, actual gameplay oh rip man rip rip because yeah the stream quality looks worse than that like we just compared it side by side <laughs> but still when you get to play it resolution wise it's gonna look a little bit better than this okay that's for damn sure okay that's for damn sure but make no mistake man like it's not gonna look any any crazy good though but uh, oh uh, 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 okay in terms of the hud yes you can turn off the hud so there is that right and, and this is good news okay i want to talk about the good stuff as well now this is something that we heard because uh, previously if you do have twitter i would love to have you on twitter i would love to have you on twitter if you do use x twitter instagram whatever you use i'd love to have you there links are always in description and in the top and comment as well right now this is good news the hud in black of six zombies can be entirely customized and even removed yes removing part that's amazing right once you learn it but still i want a little bit of it now the good news here is this right there's even a black of three zombies legacy style hud preset you can select now i'll be fully honest i'm not sure if this is that black of three zombies preset they're talking about because they did reveal this image alongside it but let me be the first one to say black of three zombies hud did not look like this it looked 10 times better than this this is not like black of three zombies hud okay this is the new black of three zombies hud like whatever they wanted this is not this is not how black of three zombies hud looked like okay it was way better than that but apparently we're hearing that news and but but if it turns out that this is how the black of three zombies if this is the black of three zombies hud they're talking about it's still gonna look like crap then you're better off the reason i'm thinking this is that quote unquote black of three zombies like hud is because you don't see the minimap so clearly they have changed it you still got the zombie health right there why do you need zombie health in zombies bruh yeah why why I, I don't get it man i don't get it I, and, and yeah to maybe the newcomers uh, to the new uh, call of duty bbc bundle riders and all that uh, maybe even the gen genuine new players that are playing call of duty right now maybe they're not understanding this and, and you know what it's not your fault maybe if you're new to call of duty if this is like your first time playing call of duty your second year your third year oh uh, hell even fourth year honestly this might actually be fun for you why because you have not played the stuff that came out before this which was superior uh than this let me actually try and find like some zombies black ops 3 zombies gameplay in the background and we'll do like a side by side comparison real quick right black ops 3 zombies just insanely light years ahead and you know what the craziest part here is that people really really think and thought that you know zombies is just gonna keep on getting better and better look at that so minimal hud and, and this is uh, how old it is I, I, is it uh i believe it was almost seven years maybe eight years okay let me see this so this game came out in 2015 so it was 2015 yeah almost nine years eight nine years oh, shit. Oh, holy crap yeah I, I guess it's gonna be nine years by november this year damn that is crazy to me man 
that is crazy to me this is nine years old and already graphically this looks better it, the, the textures look polished right and it does feel like zombies as well uh, and, and you got the hud as well and, and of course if i played the background music you know what let's do it real quick i can hear you are you, are you the one i saw in my dream yeah would you take this and i and i get that right like when this map first came out Sega also did complain but this the complaints were nowhere the like the way they are today and you look at this already night and day difference bro damn man like what are we talking about here you guys had four years man and the other and see the reason a lot of people are really really frustrated right now is because the, the intro cinematic cutscene looks very good the the map gameplay they showed the other day looks insanely good too uh and people were like we're so back we're so back we're so back it's gonna be really bad we're so back and, and they revealed this and, and people got to actually see the gameplay for themselves <laughs> and it does look like warzone uh, multiplayer now yes there are some nitpicks as well like the hud yeah some people are like hey man who cares about the hud I i'll just simply say okay forget about everything forget about everything that people are complaining about just look at the map okay forget the hud ex that exists here look at this and look at that right night and day difference bro and this is old this is almost nine nine years old objectively speaking Subjectively, you can say this is the best thing ever, and it, it, opinions wise, we all uh, opinions are like assholes, we all got it, right? If you like it, listen, man. If you like this, that's awesome, man. I'm happy for you, uh, bruh. I'm half. Oh, yeah, he was testing if the Reagan would damage him or not <laughs> after getting the PhD flopper. Okay, yeah, good shit, good shit, bruh. But, but here's the thing, though look at the map, it don't even look like zombies. That's the biggest uh, complaint, and that's the most valid criticism, objectively, okay? I also do believe that the HUD criticism is valid, even I don't like it, but I'm trying to be objective, like forget about the HUD, forget about everything, right? Forget about the perk machine looking like team from Temu, from Wish.com, from Dollarama, all that. Yeah, forget about all that. Just look at the zombies gameplay. Just like zone in completely, okay? Just zone in, look straight, tunnel vision, everybody, tunnel vision. Don't let your dragons go in the dark tunnel, by the way. Real quick, gotta, gotta say that because uh, some, some of you might be thinking about like the different kind of tunnel, okay? I don't want you guys to be thinking about that kind of tunnel but tunnel vision everybody tunnel vision okay tunnel vision let's do tunnel vision real quick okay so when you look at it like the map 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 itself damn man it looks like multiplayer it looks like that i'm playing warzone right now maybe like completing a challenge in warzone you know in blackout there were areas where zombies would spawn in i believe in yeah in, in warzone as well i haven't played warzone in the longest amount of time but even in warzone there they added zombies yeah i do remember that yeah yeah i remember that yeah it feels like that it's just one of the pov or poi yeah poi point of interest yeah po uh, poi uh, on warzone that um uh, i'm playing on warzone it looks like warzone and that's the, the 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 thing that people are actually really upset about that the map feels like multiplayer uh, and not zombies that's the biggest issue right and if you are new to call of duty and you have never played like the older games uh, in turn especially i would say the peak was black ops 2 zombies and black ops 3 zombies right black ops 4 zombies looking back it wasn't that bad but see uh, people still had the same problems with black ops 4 because they changed the point system they changed the hud which was absolutely unnecessary they added the hit marker little stuff like that and of course uh, when the game came out it was really really buggy at launch blue screens and all that right like it was the game was constantly crashing so it was there was genuine criticism but minus all that black ops 4 zombies was actually still good it was actually fun and they also tried to innovate i believe they added the uh, i don't remember what was the exact name for it but they added like the custom options where where you could start playing on any map uh starting round 5 10 15 20 50 even uh, yeah in black ops 2 zombies you could have done like on town zombies you could have started from round 20 right in black ops 3 zombies we didn't have that option in shadows of evil if you if you would shoot the shadow man then you can be on round 15 right and a lot of people right now you know after the mr t likes to find noah j beef a lot of people saying that yo noah j is the real shadow man though <laughs> yay so there's a whole lot of that but uh oh wait for it through the comments here then if you go over to reddit it's pretty much the exact same thing i'm sorry but this doesn't even look like zombies so far and when you look at the image 
I kind of get it. <laughs> Mr. Awful Waffles Damn. right there is pretty much perfect. Like, what a reaction. I get it. It looks like a multiplayer map. It really does. It kind of <laughs> looks like more of the same from what we saw back during Modern Warfare 3. My hype for Black Ops 6 Zombies after seeing the Liberty Damn. Falls gameplay. This trailer did not fit the vibe of this map at all, which kind of yeah. feels like a bait and switch to an extent because yeah. the trailer looked incredible, but then the gameplay it itself looked a bit lifeless and lackluster. So what this tells me is that people are not necessarily haters. Yes, people love to complain and hate. Everybody loves that, okay? We love drama, we love drama. That is a fact, okay? I'm not gonna deny that. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it, though. But what this tells me is that if people get something good, people can see the good. And people are gonna appreciate. Especially gamers, right? Gamers from... Uh, uh, yeah, gamers literally, right? If you give them one good thing, they will accepted and they will reply back with 10 good things or i should say like they would uh, make it sound like that instead of getting one good thing they got 10 good things in return that's how gamers are right if you give them just one little good thing they would be like oh man i got 10 good things okay so gamers do appreciate it the the, the levels compound and the opposite is true too where if you like <laughs> you know don't put the same amount of care you like bait and switch like that you you do the fans dirty this way yeah people gonna be there man people gonna complain just look at that i'm just comparing both of these gameplays side by side almost nine years gameplay here bro almost nine years old game maybe not necessarily nine years old gameplay gameplay but nine years old game okay nine years old game game versus 2024 damn look at that bro damn 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 bro and speaking of lifeless, this is coming in from Kilo Petra Games. This is a great example of how zombies used to be. Here we have Mob of the Dead, we have Darius and Draha, and then you look at the comparison, like what zombies kind of looked and felt like back in the day compared to what zombies has looked like more recently, right? Mm. It's just kind of like it's homogenizing zombies into the multiplayer and into Damn, I didn't know Letty was playing Call of Duty zombies. the Warzone experience, <laughs> and that is turning off a lot of fans. The Terminus Island gameplay looked fantastic. It looked yeah. like a true return to form for round based zombies. Mm. Fans were very excited when they saw this and of course we learned a lot more at call of the next day because, because uh, you know what if, i wouldn't be shocked if that was all rendered gameplay if that was like beefed up with rtx 50 billion no they didn't show the hud at all right they showed the good stuff and that that gameplay was very very controlled i do think that the map is gonna be good probably maybe even but but they really i, I would not be shocked if they'd done that pre-rendered uh, crap like a uh, cyberpunk because if you guys did not know cyberpunk original reveal was not actual gameplay people thought it was gameplay but later on we found out that it was actually pre-rendered yeah so it was like pre-rendered which is not real gameplay so i wouldn't be shocked i mean companies do that all the time and now we're actually seeing the real gameplay so people are seeing the mask coming off right now let me know your thoughts on on it guys check out this video on the screen insane news just came out we got the dr disrespect update right the, the dev team behind dr disrespect came out they responded and they're talking about like what went down and all that check out this video on the screen if you already seen it then check out the video on the left we got some good news about gta 6 we got brand new leaks let's hope that gta 6 carries us may and let's hope zombies turns out to be decent too when it comes out